everybody it's Mindy and look we got a great big smile today <laughs> I you know I get contacted all the time to do review stuff and I, I turn down a lot I really do um, and this one I mean I have had this product before but this one seemed unique and it's always a good item to have so I wanted to get into it and see what makes this one super cool all right are you ready to see this can you tell what it is already? Let's just get rid of that box. Clunk. All right. Yes, it is a light pad. It is a lithium battery tracing light pad. Okay. There is absolutely nothing in that box. There is nothing to indicate the company. I might have to pause momentarily. And is there anything inside? Nope. I'm going to have to pause and get the name of the company real quick. And I'll tell you how much it was, price, and all that kind of stuff. And then we'll continue going over this. I'll be right back. All right, let's continue. <clears throat> when I looked up the order, it is from a company called Tojito. Tojito. It's an A3 light pad. So if you know anything about light pads, A4 is the smallest one, like a piece of paper size. This one's a little larger. And then there is an A2. I believe there's an A1 and they just get larger and larger. So the smaller the number, the larger the light pad. So this is a good size one. All right, so what's it say right here? It's a lithium battery, has three colors. You can have the screen be different colors. Um, it has six levels of brightness. Mine has three. I think I've only seen three levels on most light pads. So that'll be interesting. Um, and we have all this information here. We'll have a scale on this side. It's slim and portable. It has light eye protection, charging. Okay, and then I think it comes on this stand, which I thought was pretty unique in and of itself. Okay, well, look at Hello, little mousy guy. <laughs> I don't know why we have a little mouse here. What in the world is all of this? No idea. <laughs> We have a mouse. We're going to trace the mouse. It is called a tracing pad. All right. But as we all know, um, you can use this for many other things besides tracing things. And us diamond painters, we know that um, they're great for, I think it's just pictures, you guys. Honestly, we got the mouse. It is. So if you want to actually trace some pictures, you can do that. We got a dolphin. <laughs> oh, look, at, we got a cute little puppy dog. All right, interesting. We got another dog. We got some flies. <laughs> All right, pictures, birds. And then tracing paper, blank tracing paper in this large size. Okay, well, fun, fun, cool. Never gotten that with a light pad or a tracing light before. <laughs> okay. All right, I'll set those aside. I can put that in there later. All right, okay, so here is our cord. <gasps> Well, that did not work well, did it? Here's our charging cord. It has a C port. I love that. I have many adapters that will take this C port. Well, no, that's not, what am I talking about? This takes the C port. Never mind. It has a USB for charging. Oh, threw me off. I had a crash over here and now I'm all, you know. All right. Anything else? Okay, what is this? I have a dowel. Okay. All right. Okay, let's set that aside. That's not going to fall off the counter. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. I like these bags. They come in this, like, foamy kind of protective bag. I like that. Um, on my larger ones, I think I have kept the boxes, and I've actually kept this in case I want to take it someplace. So, okay. So we start with this clip at the top, which is kind of cool. It has a clip here. Uh, wow, that's pretty firm. Is it magnetic? It might be. It's pretty firm, though. All right, what's on our paper here? Um, more instructions, specifications about the, the light pad, things like that. And then it has, well, that looks to be like maybe an inspection tag of some sort. Doesn't have much on it, and it's not in English, but it looks like it's an ex inspection. 
it passed. <laughs> All right. So there's just some information about the light pad that comes with it. All right. So as you can tell, it has, whoa, whoa. Okay. I didn't know it was going to come on like that quick. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, let me, let me turn it off. Oh wait, that's not off. Hang, okay. Off. Okay. What I was trying to show you <laughs> wow, was the, um, measurements on the sides. All right. They believe they look like they're in centimeters. So you have measurements on the sides. In case, if you wanted to measure something and see how big it was, this does have a plastic film on it. Yeah, that is, that's magnetic. That's cool. This has a plastic film on here that you're going to want to take off to use it. Yeah, you got to peel it off. I'm not going to peel it right now because I am not certain what I'm doing with this light pad. If I'm keeping it or giving it away or what I'm doing with it. But there is a film on there to peel off. Okay. Um, let's look at the back of it because this is unique. Okay. So it has this stand. Okay. How does it open? Well, it opens like this and then it goes like this. Cool. Look at that. Pretty easy to use. Well, sure it is. You got to go like this. Okay. Do I, do I know how sturdy it is? Do we rely on its sturdiness? It's pretty sturdy. Okay. It is pretty sturdy. Remove the protective film. Yes. Remove the protective film before you use it. That's what that says. Yes, we got it. Okay. So, I mean, and then of course it is adjustable to different heights, depending on if you wanted, this is the, this is the highest right here. All right. And then it can go as low. I mean, it can go pretty low. I think there's one more. It can go this low. So there you go. We're going to, we're going to pump it up a little bit so you can see what we're doing. This, I don't know. I don't know what this is for. Do you? Any idea? Let me know. I thought maybe it was to help prop it or something, but I really, I really don't know what that's for. And I didn't really see any indication on here of what you do with that dowel. Anything on the back? Copy paper, artwork, light pad, copy your photos, da 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 da. Hmm? No? No? I don't know. All right. Your guess is as good as mine with that. All right. So apparently this is all charged up and ready to go. We don't have to plug this thing in to make this work because it runs on a battery. That's pretty cool, right? That means no cords at all. I know some people have found a light pad that has a permanent cord. This one doesn't have a cord. All right, so let's power this puppy up. What do we get? There is one of our lights right there. All right, so what happens if we hit that again? It changes color. This is the color change. So it went from yellow to a bluish to the bright white. Let's do that again. Off. So you'll see it's yellow, the blue hue, bright white, and then off. That's pretty cool. Okay. Let's just go to the blue because it's a little easier on your eyes. Okay. And then the next button deals with the brightness. Okay, so let's see how bright it can get. Oh, it's going to go dimmer. Dim, bright, 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 off. Bright, real dim. There's, there's one, two, three, four, five, off. I only get five. I said six. I only get five, though. <laughs> Anyhow, let's try it again. One, two, three. Four, five, off. I get five. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyhow, but this is cool. Look, if you have a small painting you want to put in here, this will help hold your painting on there. It's magnetic. It hooks right to that. That is pretty nifty. Oh my gosh. And then of course, when it goes dim or the battery wears out, you have your cord and you plug it back in. Now, I wonder if it says anywhere the length of time that it will stay bright for. Um, da -dum, da -dum. Does it give us a time? Hmm. It says place it on your flat table, connect your power source. Okay, so you can 
plug it in. Um, switch your brightness. Long press the switch to adjust the brightness. I don't know. Did that do anything? <laughs> Long press. Oh, oh, look. It does it by itself. You don't have to keep hitting the button. Then I want it to go dimmer. It goes dimmer. That's pretty cool, right? You can hold the button. Nice. We already saw those different temperature or different temperatures, the different colors you can get. I wonder if that changes throughout too. Now those you have to you have to push individually. Okay, but this one. The brightness will change for you automatic. Well, that gets pretty bright. Okay, cool. I am not seeing life of the battery on here anywhere. I don't know what its life, battery life is. And I don't know if that was on the Amazon listing or not. I don't see it on the box. No. It tells us how much power it takes, all that kind of stuff. The size. But I don't see how long that battery will last. So, I mean, if you're going to be diamond painting for a long time, sure, you've got a cord. You can plug in, right? So, and I don't know how long that will stay charged. But um, if I find that, if I find it in the listing on Amazon, I'll go back and I'll look and see if it tells us. And if it does, I'll put that in here. So, anyhow, it says it's called stepless dimming. Just hold the button down and it will move and adjust the brightness brightness for you. High, middle, low. There you go. All right. That's pretty cool. Huh? Um, there's a red light on when the power is low. Okay. So when the power is low, a red light will come on. That's nice. And then, you know, hey, you better plug it in. And there's a blue light when the battery is full power. I don't see any lights at all, so I don't know where that would be. <laughs> Is it over here in this corner, under here or something? No, that's just to take your film off. I don't see any lights, do you? So, I don't know. We must not need charging, but we're not full power. <laughs> that's all I can figure. I don't know where there, there would be a light. I'm looking for a light. and Oh, just turned everything off. Hmm, I don't know. I have no idea where it lights up. Anyhow, over here, this is, okay, there is no light. Okay, I can see where there is a light. Here is where you plug in, is right over here. There's your port to plug in, and there is a light here, but we just don't have any light on at all. So we must not be um, going, our battery must not be running out, and we're not fully charged either one. So we're not getting a red or a blue light. <laughs> we're getting no light at all. <laughs> yeah, there is no, no light coming out of there. <laughs> Anyhow, it's a very nice light pad. What do you think? I think it's pretty cool. I like it. I love that it will run on battery. Um, I like the stand. Look, it is, it's, it's stable. It's, it's sturdy. And then this magnetic clip at the top, that is pretty, ow, I pinched my finger. Don't do that. Uh, that's pretty nifty. The magnet there. That's cool. All right. Well, that's what I got, you guys. Um, I will link it below. You can check them out on Amazon and uh, see what you think, okay? And I gotta decide what I'm doing with this one. I do have another light pad this size. I don't know. I'm trying to think, do I have a friend that needs one? I might, we'll see. Anyhow, that's what I have, guys. Check it out. It's pretty cool, pretty nifty. All right. Um, thanks for watching everybody. Hey, if you have, oh, I know what this is. Okay, when I looked at it this way, do you see what's inside? Lead. It's a pencil. It's just a pencil, you guys. It's a tracing pad, so they gave us a pencil. <laughs> All right, now I know. Okay. All right, now you can go trace whatever you want. You got a pencil. Have fun. Okay. All right. Thanks, everybody. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Come back. See more stuff. Um, I'm always coming up with something. All right. I will talk to everybody soon. Bye, everybody.